Hey, what's going on everyone? This is iReviews back with another video and back with another 10 city tweaks compatible with iOS 11. So for this video, I have 10 really cool tweaks. Let's go ahead and show you guys all those awesome tweaks. I hope you guys are enjoying this series of videos. I will show you guys every single tweak compatible with iOS 11 that I can find. So yeah, let's get started with part three of the top 10 city tweaks compatible with iOS 11. The first tweak for this video is called Pulse Hood and it's pretty awesome. It will replace the stock volume hood of iOS and you can see this cool animation right there as I'm turning up the volume of my device. So you can see it goes from red, it turns green when you turn up all the way up the volume. So you can see right there turning down the volume, it will turn red. So under settings here, you have the enable button. You can choose the color right here or you can enable red to green so it will change based on the volume the percentage of the volume that you turn up or down charge mode this tweak will show you this awesome charging screen right here on the lock screen while you're charging your device you can see it looks pretty awesome these dots right here indicate how much your battery is charged and of course you will have the clock right there to dismiss it you just tap there and it will take you to your lock screen it's as easy as that to install this tweak you will need a repo which of course you can find in the description finger touch this tweak allows you to set actions to the home button simply by touching it so for example you can touch once to go to the home screen or you, i can touch and just hold the finger there it will lock my device so you will have different actions here you can change oops you can change that by going to the settings of this tweak so right here we'll have the actions if you go to one of them you can choose whatever action you want to perform using that gesture Swipe for more allows you to easily install and uninstall packages on Cydia. All you have to do is just swipe like this on a package and it will show you all these buttons when you can queue installation, queue reinstall, remove them or you can basically clear them if you have one on the queue so easier with this than with the stock way that Cydia uses. You, you have to go through the package page and all, all that. With this tweak installed you will have these shortcuts. You can do all that from the list right here. Curtain. This is a pretty cool tweak as it will change the text right here with the icon of the app. Now I have opened this link from the App Store. So basically the breadcrumb that you see here, it would normally be App Store right here. But what this tweak does is that it will remove the text and will replace it with the icon of the app that did redirect you to this website. Or if you open any link to, to another app from an app that will have the icon of the app from where you come not the name of the app so it will change to the icon it takes less space here and it looks really cool tap controller this tweak will add some really really awesome controls to the default video player of ios so if i tap up here you can see i can go ahead and just move 10 seconds ahead or if I tap down here, I can turn on the brightness. So on the right side, you turn up the brightness. On the left side, right here, you can turn down the brightness. And here you can go back. Here you can go forward. It's pretty awesome. Under the settings, you can basically go ahead and configure how many seconds you want to skip forward or backwards when double tapping on the screen when you're watching a video on the default video player. Pause on mute is a tweak that will pause your music once you turn the volume all the way down. So you can see right there, if I turn the volume all the way down, it will pause the music that was playing in the background. Switch Tint allows you to customize the switches system-wide. So you can see right here, blue and brown color. So you can change that to any color you want. So here is this. here are the settings of this tweak. So basically you can change the color of the switch, the thumb and the disable outline. So you just go to one of them and just pick any color that you like. Blord. This tweak will give your device a system wide black keyboard. So you can see right here on iMessage, I have this dark keyboard. It's pretty awesome. It looks really cool, especially at night when you're typing, you don't have that bright keyboard. And also, if you jump to the settings of this tweak, all you have here is a switch where you can enable or disable it. Steel Meme is a fun tweak that will change the save image text to Steel Meme. It's basically just a fun, a fun tweak, nothing that useful, but when you want to save an image anywhere on your device, it will show you Steel Meme instead of Save Image. 
that's it for this video guys i hope you guys enjoyed the tweaks i will be releasing more videos once i find more tweaks that are compatible with ios 11 go ahead and subscribe to not miss those videos and i will see you guys on the next one